What's up boys and girls? So for us avid Jackass fans, we should be well aware of the fact that there is a fourth Jackass movie coming in October of this year, and it will feature the original cast, minus Ryan Dunn, rest in peace, and Bam Margera. Originally, it was going to feature Bam, but unfortunately Bam was fired for not complying with a contract where he had to take multiple drug tests, take his pills, get therapy, etc. He's just not 100% mentally stable, which sucks because Bam was like my idol growing up, and seeing your idol turn into a mess isn't fun. Like, I've been a fan of Jackass probably like most of you. I used to come home from school, put on MTV2, and watch reruns of Jackass, Viva La Bam, Bam's Unholy Union, Wild Boys, anything involving the Jackass crew, I would watch. In fact, I was so obsessed with Jackass that I started skateboarding because of Bam, and I even used to film myself doing dumb stunts too with my friends. Now, I never listened to that warning label at the beginning of each episode, because I always felt like I was just built different. Luckily Bam decided a few days ago to go to Florida and get help from a reputable person who has helped other celebrities get sober, which is fantastic news and I wish Bam luck as always and I really hope he pulls through this time. But anyways, this video isn't about Bam, it's about Johnny Knoxville. According to a GQ interview with Knoxville, he said that Jackass 4 will be his last contribution to the franchise. Which I'm honestly not surprised about. I mean, I just found out today that the guy is 50 years old, and he's been doing crazy shit for our entertainment for decades at this point. He said the following to GQ, You could only take so many chances before something irreversible happens, Knoxville told GQ in an interview. I felt like I've been extremely lucky to take the chances I've taken and still be walking around. Johnny also publicly acknowledged the drama involving himself and Bam Margera. And by the way, I guess I lied. This video is partially about Bam. Bam put out a few Instagram posts recently involving Johnny and the Jackass director, Jeff Tremaine, about how both of them have been apparently screwing him over. And Knoxville said in the interview that he just wants Bam to get better and that he doesn't want to get involved with the nonsense publicly. Which again, I don't blame the guy. Anyways, I wouldn't be surprised if this was just the last Jackass film in general. All of the crew are getting super old. Like Steve-O and Chris Pontius, Dave, Preston, everyone in the group is just getting old. Even without Bam being a part of this film, I'll still be checking out Jackass 4 when it does premiere on October 22nd in theaters. At least I think it's going to be in theaters. I have no idea. I just hope that this film is a good send-off to the franchise. I want to see dicks flying. I want to see asses flying. I want to see dicks and asses flying. And this film better be dedicated to Ryan Dunn. But yeah, I'm very excited to see this new film. I'm kind of sad that this might possibly be the last project in the Jagass franchise. It's going to be sad to let it go, but there's always reruns. Anyway, if you enjoyed today's video, do me a favor, smash the like button down below, subscribe to the channel, click the bell icon, follow me on all my social links, and join my Discord server. Links are in the description below. Have a great day, everyone. And remember, dicks and asses better be in this movie. <laughs>